Sync2 PST is a downloadable PC application that allows you to synchronize Microsoft Outlook PST files. Step 1. Open the first PST file. Each computer with Microsoft Outlook has its own .pst file to store Outlook information in its folders. Sync2 PST has been designed primarily as a personal synchronization tool, but you can also use this tool for synchronizing or sharing selected Outlook folders with your family, friends, and coworkers. Synchronization can be made via a shared PST file located in a shared folder of the same PC, your network, USB flash, or hard drives. Sync2 PST application can be accessed via the program's menu or by clicking on the tray icon or via the desktop icon. Step 1. Open the first PST file. Click this button to open your default Outlook PST file. The Open or Create New PST File dialog will open and show your default Outlook PST location. Select your default PST file, usually named Outlook.pst. Click Open. Step 2. Open slash create the second shared PST file. Click the Open PST 2 button. The Open or Create New PST File dialog will open. If you know the location of your shared .pst file, change path and select it. As this is our first time synchronizing, let's choose our USB drive. This would be our location for the shared PST file. Type the preferred name for your shared PST file. For example, shared. Click Open. Click Yes to create your shared PST file in the selected shared folder. Select folders you want to sync from the folder structure of both PST files or select folders only from one folder structure if you want to copy the selected folder information to the other PST. In this example, we selected folders from PST1 file, Outlook Default. This will add or update the contents of the selected folder, folders, at the same locations in the shared file, PST2. Finally, we synchronize selected PST files. For this example, we selected Write Sync. Write Sync will transfer information from your Outlook PST file to your shared PST file. Data in Outlook folders on the left will overwrite data in the shared files on the right. Let's now share and synchronize this PST file with another PC. Press Close to exit. Before we share and synchronize the PST file with another PC, let's see what some of our existing Outlook items look like. After we start Sync2 PST and open the default Outlook PST file on this PC, let's open the second, Shared PST file. Clicking on Open after locating the shared PST file that we created on the USB drive previously. Next, let's select the folders to synchronize on PST2. This will add or update the contents of the selected folder, Folders, at the same locations in PST1 file, Outlook. Let's click Left Sync now. Left Sync will transfer information from the shared PST file to your Outlook file. Data in the shared folders on the right will overwrite data in Outlook folders on the left. That's it. Synchronization is complete. Now all your updates and changes in synchronized Outlook folders will be in sync with the other PC. Next, let's quickly see what settings we have. On the Settings window, you can set up manual or automatic synchronization, schedule your automatic synchronization, and adjust filters. Sync2 PST gives you an option to automatically or manually synchronize your PST files. With Automatic Sync, you can choose from different schedule settings. On the Synchronization Options tab, you can adjust filters for each folder type.
choose to show or not to show synchronization changes, and adjust conflict resolution rule. Synchronization filters can be applied to each type of folder. Filters will allow you to synchronize Outlook data that actually needs to be synchronized. Without filters, all data of the selected folders during the first synchronization will be published at the shared location. In most cases, it is not necessary and makes the first synchronization very difficult. If this option is chosen, after each synchronization, the dialog Found Changes will open, and you'll be able to select what new data or updates you want to exclude from this synchronization. This is the Advanced Options tab. You can here select the criteria that will be used to determine identical items during synchronization. Sync to PST will compare both files and match the entries by the criteria set here. Click Close. Let's see if Outlook on this PC reflects the new synchronization data. Yes, it does. That brings us to the end of this demo. Thank you for viewing this demo. You saw how easily you can sync important emails, tasks, contacts, and calendar appointments instead of copying all that data from computer to computer. For next steps, please follow the links below.